Oh, let's go through some street stuff. Paris Fashion Week street stuff. So it's now Paris Fashion Week. I'm sure most of you guys are aware. Um, loads, all the industry insiders and movers and shakers are in Paris showcasing their gear. It's pretty cool to see that although people keep saying streetwear is over, streetwear is over. All the big streetwear brands that you know and love are having their showrooms based in Paris during menswear uh, collection showing. I'm pretty sure because all the buyers around are, are around, right? Because I'm sure if you're a store that's buying men's fashion, you're probably going to buy men's streetwear too. It's going to be hand in hand. It's going to follow the Dover Street market model. So everyone that's in the industry that's part of the kind of menswear streetwear side of things is in Paris at the moment. And obviously the street style is one of the biggest things to kind of pop out during the whole time. People wearing all their wacky clothes. But it's, there are sometimes some good little nods as to what you can expect for the seasons to come. You know, usually people here are pushing the envelope and setting the trends for the new stuff coming forward. You know, not for me personally, because, you know, wouldn't be caught dead wearing some of the stuff that these people are wearing. But it's a podcast. Make it entertaining. Let's look at some of these people are wearing and go from there. So... This is from Vogue, courtesy of Phil O, who I'm sure you guys are aware of, is one of the big uh, proponents of the street where the street style pictures. Let's go through some stuff and see what I think is look it looks good. Um, so you've got here somebody wearing Vlone, a pretty uh, tubby guy. It might be Young Lord himself, and you've got my man um, Quaver here. I quite like Quaver's outfit actually. <laughs> Are those Jordan 4s or are those uh, Virgil shoes? I'm not too sure. No, I think they might be Jordan 4s, actually. I quite like them. They are Jordan 4s. I like his jeans. Kind of a, a slightly boot-cut style, which is all the rave now at the moment. Everyone's sort of wearing boot-cut style jeans at the moment, um, which is great to see. Uh, the skinny jeans are over for the most part. So if you're wearing skinny jeans, it's, it's done It's done out here for you. Uh, you've got here... So I forgot the guys from Boy Better Know. I forgot, his, I forgot their names, but they're dressed as well. Head to toe in off-white, it looks like. For the most part, not a fan of either outfit. You've got this lady here wearing a furry coat. You've got this guy wearing... Imagine imagine making those Virgil shoes look shit. This guy here, I think that that's the guy from Ghetto Kitchen or something, right? You've got some sort of kitchen stuff. But look at this guy here on the left. He's wearing the Virgil Dunks and he strangled them. I don't know how you can strangle the Virgil Dunks and make them look terrible, but this guy has achieved them. So congratulations to you. you got Cohen Frost, the OG, wearing the old school uh, chomper hoodie with the billionaire boys club jeans you know i like seeing something like a Kerwin frost get money because he's an old school streetwear guy like me and all the things that he missed out on all the things that he was too poor or too um lacking in resources to acquire he's now buying in the droves he's buying all the archive all the old school pieces that only heads would know about and care about he's got the old school billionaire boys club t uh, jeans on with a massive dog uh screen print on the front they used to crack all the time and looked all shitty and cheap the more you wore them Oh man, so so cool to see. Um, you got another guy here wearing a really oversized outfit, which looks great. So it's brown, uh, check outfit looks great. I don't know who it's by, but it looks really cool. It's cut amazing. Look how oversized everything looks, but nothing looks like it's dragging. That's that's perfect. Expert tailors, at, um, craftsmanship. They are tailoring. This guy here in the background wearing everyone that's wearing these Nike Dunks by Off White are terrible, isn't it? He's got like a chain across his suit, pink hair, the millionaires and those dunks. It's a terrible outfit, but hey, what can you do? Um, I like this girl's um, wallabies. They look quite nice. This guy's top is nice. Actually, the outfit on the right is probably the nicest thing on the in the kind of image. But again, it's probably boring for a street style way. I like that shirt there. This pleated top is really interesting. This guy there looks cool too. I like the combination. It's like the grey, like olivey style. And he's wearing those boots that are meant to be a little bit, they're a little bit basic bitch in it. What are they called again? They're like the LA favorite of a Chelsea boot. They're a bit, you know, New York favorite wearing, you know, with like a gilet, but I like them. They look pretty cool there. Um, oh, I like these trousers. What the fuck are these trousers models wearing? I'm pretty sure he's a model, right? Wow. So he's got these tabby boots on, the tabby high heeled boots on, and these amazing, I'm not sure if they're like, they're like disco infused leggingy type things. There's a guy here in the background who's got my Jaden boots on, but they're brand new, so they don't have my uh, slanted heel that I have on mine, which I probably have to get replaced, or I probably have to buy a new pair because mine are banged up, but they look really cool. Um, you've got a cheetah print top on there. So again, loads of really slim... There's not skinny. It's probably the skinniest thing I've seen so far. A lot of like regular st regular sized uh, trousers out here, isn't it? It looks like so far. Everyone's kind of switching. This guy looks a little bit like um, Review Bruh. You know the guy that the reviews all the fast food on YouTube and stuff and reviews burgers from Burger King. It looks a little bit like him, innit? Um, 
you got this guy wearing a terrible outfit too. It's like a mix between, I don't know, tech wear and I don't know what else. Is that a junior top or a com top with some weird chest rig thing and his pants that look strange and uh, are those the shocks that Virgil did a collaboration with? Yeah, they, it, it might be all, all com thing because he's got those com trainers on. But yeah, I don't like the outfit. I think it looks pretty shitty. What's his name? Jean-Jacques uh Dio, Jolly Jolly the, I'm sure the N is silent but yeah it doesn't look too great I quite like Tiger's outfit I would have swapped it there the Dunks would Air Force One or Jordan with white Air Forces I quite like Tiger's outfit he's got an off-white denim denim suit on it looks really cool it's kind of uh, got his patterns all over him and stuff and he's got the mini lens on of course I think that looks really that really suits him pretty well um I'm not a fan of whatever this woman's wearing. No, I'll pass. I like the guy ninja outfit there at the background. Don't like his shoes. Those shoes got to die, innit? Um, what are they called again? Um, they like the they like the hipster version of like the feelers that all the basic girls wear. You know the stacked feelers. What are these shoes called, man? Um, damn it, I've got the name of them. The massive platform trainers that everyone's got at the moment. Oh. But yeah, they need to they need to die already. Too many um, basic people wearing them. And again, if you're going to wear those boots, wear them like you you wear them every day. Don't wear them brand new for one occasion like they're some special item. Because they're really not. Um, I quite like that kilt. That's quite nice. Those Air Force Ones, what are they? Are they Air Force Ones? Is that collaboration? It is a collaboration. Oh, those are the phone posts that Air Force Ones, I think, right? you got Pop Smokers out there. That's pretty cool, isn't it? He looks great, man. He's got an off-white sort of like bathrobe on, some jeans. And some white trainers, really trap star, fantastic. He's got all his jewels on because he is pop smoke, you know. And then you've got here some nice outfit too, boots. Here's what it is. That suit's quite great. Uh, Tiffany Goody, whatever that name is. You've got, uh, who's this guy? Tyrod Taylor. I'm not sure who that is. I'm not sure. I don't really like the outfit either, to be fair. I think that's a Virgil jacket. And those bottoms would cinch up. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I'm not going to. There's more said, less said the better. Oh, they are Jordans, isn't it? You've got here another good outfit. Uh, and then you've got here. That's Shirelle, isn't it? Shirelle. Shirelle, yeah? DJ, okay. She's doing a damn thing. She's out here, out in Paris, getting decked out with Virgil stuff. That's great to see. Big up her. You've got Declan Chan in JW Anderson shirt. Not a big fan of it. I think he's probably too short to wear that. You've got Takashi Murakami, always looking the best. I like what he wears. Uh, these outfits I'm not too fan of. I'm not sure who that guy is, but I'm not a fan of that either. Some good stuff, man. Some good patterns and stuff, whatever. But most of the stuff's a little bit gaudy for my liking. You've got Tommy Ton out there. Is he taking pictures as well? Has he got his camera on him? No, he's not in it. He's doing his own brand at the moment, so he's probably not. But yeah, I'm not a fan of anything anyone's wearing here. Heron Preston looking good, actually. He's got a good outfit on there. Is that his own brand stuff? Probably is, right? Yeah, so he's doing a damn thing. Here he's Mrs. Riding the thing. Some guy called Mark Fawn in F in an off-white shirt. Don't like that at all. Pfft, nope, thank you. One of you bloody Osiris there doing his thing. Uh, ooh, yeah. That's a great outfit, isn't it? Kirby from Pia Moss doing a damn thing. And Ke so this lady, Kennedy Yanko. Yeah, he looks banging. I love the boots. I love the jeans. I love that PVC whatever it is leather overcoat i love the trap star chains banging uh oh look at that rick outfit oh oh slide what what is this picture 37 i'm gonna put this as the image for the cover of the show oh that rick outfit is banging i think it's all rick right rick dunks and the girl next oh what the f who is that that outfit is banging Woohoo! that's an outfit for me those original Rick Dunks cannot be tested, can they? Cannot be tested. But yeah, big up him. And yeah, everyone's doing their thing, man. These two models look great too. <laughs> I love everything. Uh, who's that guy? Evan Mock in Off-White. He looks quite cool, actually, in that. He, he actually makes Off-White look really decent here, this guy. I quite like that outfit. It looks really cool on him. <laughs> um, Not a fan of Justin Bones' outfit at all. Uh, that's the guy from High Snobiety. Not a fan of what he wears at all. Luke obviously wearing the great stuff. Standard uh, Rick Owens and jeans combo that he loves to wear when he's out in Paris. So that looks great. Um, yeah, some good stuff here, man. Oversized jacket. you got Jess, Josh Post Petkowitz, the old school GQ or street style Don. Uh, oh, are those, are those um, 
Those are the Prada boots, right? They're so nice, man. So fucking nice. I love those shoes. But yeah, um, great for uh, great look from everyone involved, I guess. Paris streetwear, street style makes me jealous. I wish I was out there. Oh, I like the way he styled these. Um, the same. He's got my uh, wave runners, black laces described, and these weird jeggy type. What are they? Like a padded trousers. That's weird way. I like how he styled those shoes. Look pretty cool there. But yeah. Great overall. Everyone's doing a damn thing. Um, keep it up as per usual. Or keep it up. I don't know. What would you say to people when they're wearing good outfits? You say keep it up. You don't say keep it up, do you? But yeah. <laughs> Whatever, man. Uh, street style courtesy of Philip. Yo. I'll put it on the show notes for you guys to check out yourselves. If you're listening via the audio, it's a bit annoying me describing and going, ooh, ah, of the trousers. But I'll link in the show notes for you guys checking it out. But anyway.